Your weather watch is continuing, and we have a host in training. Mr. Rick Mercer is joining us today, Hello. learning how to do the weather. I certainly am. Now, with snow coming into Commuters southern Ontario. on the western end of the GTA, Paul, sorry. He's going to read the news for us in a second, too. Do you know what we're going to teach him how to do? We're going to teach you how to use the code straighter. Commuters on, sorry. You know, look, take what? Watch, we're going to do a split screen. Mm -hmm. Okay, so hang on. Here we go. Yeah. And you can do your, yeah. Okay. Hang on, I'm going to clear it for you. Now, you're going to use clouds. And there we go. We can use a little bit of wind. Now touch. Touch anywhere. Oh, it's and windy in Ottawa. In Peterborough, it's windy. Let's do some thunderstorms. In Niagara Falls, it's windy. In Toronto, windy. <laughs> and thunder snow. No. Sarnia. <laughs> I'm going to Nothing leave. going on in Sarnia. If you're in Sarnia, tweet me. Tell me what's going on in Sarnia. Because right now, according to what's the name of the computer? Code Strader. Hal says... Nothing's going on in Sarnia. I'm going to leave you to do the news Harry right now. Sound. Commuters on the western end of the GTA Jeez. polished up their winter skills this morning. A narrow streamer off Lake Ontario brought heavy snow just as the morning drive was kicking in. Now, for some, this morning's drive was a warm-up for what is on the way. A system in the U.S. is pushing up a messy mix of snow, rain, and freezing rain into Ontario. Snow from that system is already falling in the north. It's expected to start in the south during the overnight hours. I sound like I know what I'm doing. And that could have freezing rain in time for the morning drive. If you have to be on the road tomorrow, Sergeant Dave Woodford from the OPP has this advi advice about handling an icy road. Stay home. All right. Okay, now we go over to the weather wall with Carrie for the weather at the wall. He's a pro, isn't he? He's an absolute Don't pro. Don't be nervous, Carrie. Oh, my gosh. You know how stressful this is here? Come on, Carrie. Take a look. This is what's going on in Ontario today. What we are seeing is uh, really calm conditions across the southwest, but snow is moving into the overnight, and Rick's going to tell us what's going to be happening with the freezing rain. So now you've learned today all your new weather techniques. Yes. All right, you have to... What's he going? <laughs> yes, that is Southern Ontario. Southern Ontario. All right, so freezing rain, ice pellets. Shania's from there. And Timmins. And Timmins. Uh, so what's going, we've got freezing rain, ice pellets moving in throughout the overnight period. But look at this, we've got rain, warmer temperatures. How do you, th how do you feel about doing the wall here? I like the wall. Do you? I'm all about the wall. What do you prefer, the news or doing weather? The wall weather? of weather. The wall of weather. All right, let's go to Atlantic I like the news Canada. It's written down. This is where you. This is where you're from now. Give I us the forecast. Indeed. There we go. That's where I'm from. <laughs> you have to work from both sides. This is oh, the problem. Oh, I see. Okay, you have to gotcha, turn gotcha. And work from. See, Sorry. giving. This is giving instruction live on television. All right, there you go. Wind There's warnings. Written down in front of me. Okay. Well, wind warnings. There's wind warnings in St. John's, Gander, Twillingate, and uh, Burgio. And I don't even know if that's true, but I'm guessing it's probably true because it's this time of the year. Moving over now to... Um, Here, Corner I'll move Brook. it for him. There we go. And now Burgio, that's where Ron James's people are from. And Sydney, <laughs> that's where you get the ferry. We've got to wrap up now. And we'll go into Alberta. We'll find out what's happening across the country with your full long-range forecast details. And Sydney. Woo! With your long-range forecast details, here's Rick Mercer. This is what's happening in southern Ontario. Tell them for Tuesday, this wintry oh, the mix. Long -range you got to go from the other I'm side. I'm going to make this up. The long-range forecast side, Rick. in uh, southern Ontario. Is it southern we're doing? Yes. The long-range forecast in southern Ontario. Snow, snow, lots more snow. It's probably going to be really cold. You want to plug in your car, all that good stuff. Uh, you want to have your uh, shovel nearby. You want to have your ice, your uh, icy, salty, scraper. icy stuff. Scraper. I uh, know. I was thinking the stuff you put on the sidewalk. You know, the uh, eats the ice there. That's good. You want to put that down. Uh, give the young fellow next door maybe ten bucks. Keep your shovel out. You'll be good. How about a snowblower? And if you've got a snowblower, uh, you can have another job. We you never see? had a snowblower growing you did, up. You no, just had to use the shovel. My father's out shoveling now. He's like, you know, he's a, he's an older man. He shouldn't be shoveling. No, but he, he absolutely on not. Doing it. All right. Well, let's take a look here at Wednesday into Thursday. We've got a new area of low pressure moving into southern Ontario that will provide more Low snow. pressure. He'll, I'll talk, he'll point. And what we have is uh, that moving in for Friday, 5 to 10 centimeters right across southern Ontario into Montreal, Ottawa, and then eventually into Maritimes. Thanks, yes. Rick. <laughs>